Famous Autopsies Part 3, where I break down celebrity autopsy reports, trigger warning depiction of death. I cannot think of a celebrity death with more disturbing twists and turns than Johnny Lewis. Best known for being one of Katy Perry's boyfriends and portraying a beloved character on Sons of Anarchy, Lewis seemed to turn into a different person overnight. This one's especially gruesome. Police responded to a disturbance at a California home in 2012 to find a man lying dead in the driveway. They had received calls about a woman screaming. The man was identified to be 28-year-old Johnny Lewis. He had a deep wound to his chest, multiple bruises, and scrapes to his neck and arms. He was already in a state of rigor mortis and had skin slippage to his chest and torso. He also had a huge gaping wound to his head that revealed brain matter. Inside the home, the body of an 81-year-old woman was found. She had been brutally beaten to death. Her head was nearly caved in, leaving her unrecognizable, and the entire upstairs looked like it had been ripped apart. An investigation would later reveal that Johnny Lewis murdered her just before his own death. The examination of Lewis revealed that he had been partially strangulated, but it wasn't his cause of death. There were several deep nail marks on both sides of his neck. He had severe bleeding in the tissue of his neck muscles on the right side, and his thyroid cartilage was fractured, which is located just below the chin in front of the throat. The front left of his skull was broken in several places. He had widespread hemorrhaging or bleeding in multiple layers of his brain tissue and bleeding into his spinal fluid. He suffered complete fractures to multiple vertebrae in his spine. His right lung was collapsed, obviously caused by trauma. His aorta artery was intact, but surrounded by an effusion of blood as well as the middle section of his esophagus. His death was classified as an accident due to a fall. Evidence on the scene suggested that he had fallen from the top of the home. It is inconclusive whether or not he died on impact. The woman found murdered was the homeowner and Johnny Lewis's landlady. Some medical experts believe that a serious motorcycle accident that occurred prior to Johnny's death was a factor. Though no direct evidence was found, it's believed that it may have provoked his deteriorating mental status that was obvious in the months leading up to his death. 